welcome anywhere. Now get the out of my bar. Just give me one more drink and then I'll leave. Deadpool and Wolverine, the new film from Marvel Studios releasing in July 2024, already possessed the record for the most movie trailer views of all time with a staggering 365 million. Its latest trailer has shattered records once again, showcasing the unique style that fans have come to love from the franchise. In fact, the trailer itself received a trailer highlighting just how massive any reveal about the film is. Today on Screen Rant, we're looking at what records the film has already broken, as well as which ones it may shatter when it releases come July. As expected, the new trailer for Deadpool and Wolverine has set a new record for the most swear words in a Marvel trailer, surpassing the entire MCU combined according to LAD Bible. But it's not just about the swear words. Another intriguing record is that of the longest running appearance of a Marvel character in film. Jackman previously held the record alongside Patrick Stewart when they appeared in 2017's Logan as Wolverine and Charles Xavier respectively. They were both surpassed by Tobey Maguire's Peter Parker and Wilhelm Dafoe's Norman Osborn in 2021's Spider-Man No Way Home. Patrick Stewart then took the record back over when he appeared in Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness in 2022, but the record will revert back to Jackman this July when Deadpool and Wolverine brings his total years playing the character to 24 going all the way back to 2000's X-Men. Michael Keaton's appearance as Batman in The Flash gives him the longest run for a superhero at 33 years, which would be tough for Jackman to end up surpassing. However, if Wolverine ends up appearing in the upcoming Avengers Secret Wars film, he'll have a chance to surpass other actors who have 20 plus year character runs, including Vin Diesel's Dominic Toretto and a couple of other Fast and Furious cast members, as well as Tom Cruise's Ethan Hunt from Mission Impossible. With the combined star power of Reynolds and Jackman, Deadpool and Wolverine has a real shot of breaking the 1 billion mark at the box office, making it the first R-rated film in the MCU to achieve such a feat. In fact, Deadpool and Wolverine could potentially surpass Joker's record as the highest grossing R-rated film of all time when it raked in 1.079 billion in 2019. Joker's sequel will release this year as well, so if Deadpool and Wolverine breaks its record, it'll be interesting to see if it ends up keeping it. Boys are so silly. Either way, Deadpool and Wolverine is poised to be a true game changer with the potential to solidify its place in cinematic history. Thank you for joining us on Screen Rant, and as always, happy watching.